Hey guys, welcome to Berwick Mitsubishi. My name's Josh. Today, we're doing a walk around video on something a little different. It is an Isuzu D-Max. Uh, it is a 2014 model. And guys, this car is the ideal work vehicle. Starting off at the front, I'm just gonna show you how incredible this car looks just from the video itself. You can see this beautiful chrome grille in the front and those large projector headlights that just give you that plenty of visibility on the road. This car does also come with fog lights um, in case you do need the extra visibility and foggy conditions. Uh, and guys, the front of this car actually presents in really good condition. I can't see any touch-ups or anything at all. Uh, moving around to the uh, first alloy wheel here. It is in excellent condition considering this is a work vehicle and plenty of tread left in that Goodyear tire as well. This side of the car, just like the front of it, does present in incredible condition considering it is a work vehicle. We've got those chrome side mirrors here just to give everyone around you just a more visibility and uh, even at night it just helps, uh, helps other people see the car a little bit more. And we've got the indicators built into the side mirrors as well. Then we've got chrome uh, color matched side uh, door handles as well. Now looking up above the car, we've got the roof racks, the sports bars, and everything you could possibly need to store things on top of the vehicle, and genuine uh, smoked weather shields as well, just in case you want to put your window down and get a little bit of fresh air in, uh, when it's raining. It does have side steps as well, for those of you who are on the shorter side, if it'll just help you get into the vehicle just a little bit easier. Now looking at the back of this back wheel of this car as well, guys, I'm just going to show you all the wheels in this car are in really good condition considering it is a work vehicle and Goodyear tires are all around as well so you know they're quality tires. Now the back of this car as well you've got a, a genuine Isuzu D-Max uh, tonneau cover and as I said before the black sports bars just to give you a little bit of extra storage space. Now I will note that these do have an 80 kilo weight rating so be careful what you're putting up there. Uh, if it is over 80 kilos I would not recommend it. Now open, opening up the torno cover is just as simple as peeling it back and opening it up. Now something to note, this car does not have a tub liner currently, but if you were looking to uh, put a tub liner in it to protect it from any more scratching, that is something we can organize at an extra cost. And it does have the genuine floor mats in this model as well. All right, closing that back up, moving along this side of the vehicle, guys, once again, really good condition. and. Plenty of tread in that near immaculate wheel as well. Being the side that is the most often scratched, especially in a work vehicle, these wheels present in incredible condition. It's something you need to see for yourself in person. Now, once again, chrome door handles, no scratches on it at all, as you can see. And this side of the car, once again, guys, I cannot fault this vehicle. It's an ideal work vehicle, and being a four door, five seater, it is a pretty incredible uh, family car in, uh, in conjunction with the work vehicle. Now what we're going to do is open the bonnet and have a look at the engine. Guys, here we are looking at the Isuzu diesel engine. Now it is a four-cylinder three-liter turbo diesel with a five-speed automatic gearbox. It's got six airbags, uh, 130 kilowatts and 380 meet newton meters of torque. It is a 76 liter diesel fuel tank and depending on what you're carrying, how you drive, uh, what kind of what you're towing you can get an average fuel consumption of 8.1 liters and as as well as depending on your driving style you could get an average fuel distance of 938 kilometers for a full tank all right guys here we are inside this Isuzu D-Max just starting off in the driver's side door we've got all our power window controls your front being automatic up and down then we've got the door lock and the window lock in case your kids are getting a bit annoying in the back you can actually just lock the windows so they can't play with the windows now on the right hand side here just uh, where my right hand is we have our uh, cluster brightness controls so if the cluster is getting too bright for you at night you can actually just turn it down now next to that we've got all our power mirror switches the and a switch that lets you uh, fold the mirrors in just to avoid being hit in parking lots or on the actual work site. Now it, looking into the dash itself, we have a digital display right in the middle of the rev, rev taco and the speedometer. And on this very nice three spoke leather wrapped steering wheel, the cruise control settings are on the right hand side here and all your phone and media settings on the left. 
And moving on into the middle, just looking up at the rear view mirror, uh, it does have the camera built in there as well, which I'm not sure the camera will pick up, but it does give you a very clear indication of what's behind you. And the mirror itself will actually dim if the person behind you's got their high beams on or uh, there is a little bit too much glare coming in from the sun. Now in the center console, all our hard buttons for our radio, we've got a uh, USB, AM, FM radio, and Bluetooth audio in this model as well. And below that, all our uh, air conditioning settings. And your shifter, which if you put into drive, you can just knock it to the side and shift through the gears manually. Now behind that, we've got our hard handbrake, two very nicely sized cup holders, and plenty of storage in the center console as well. What I'll do now is, while the camera pans around the inside of the vehicle, I'm just going to get the service books out and uh, show you the service history. So it has actually had consistent servicing. Guys, not a single service missed right up until we got it into our stock at 110,000 Ks, where we have done an intimate service uh, 2,000 kilometers before the actual service reminder. Now guys, you can see this car is in incredible condition, so what we will do now is jump outside and wrap up the video. Guys, thank you for taking the time out of your day to watch the walk around video on this Isuzu D-Max. As you can see guys, for a work vehicle, this is in incredible condition. Get in fast because it will not last long. Now this car does actually can, uh, qualify for a premium mechanical protection plan, and what that is, is something you definitely want to consider for a work vehicle. It covers you for five years or 200,000 kilometers on the clock, uh, on 181 mechanical and electrical parts of the vehicle. Now that is your best cover next to new car warranty. And on top of all the great bonuses you get with that, you also get 10 years of platinum roadside assistance. So the absolute highest level of roadside assistance available in Victoria. And it is nationwide as well. Now guys, if you wanna come check this car out, take it for a test drive or see just how perfect it is for all your work needs, give us a call on 9907 My name is Josh and have a great day.